Yo, what's up guys? So I was thinking to give you like a quick HTML and CSS um, challenge or idea on how to get started. So when I first started learning HTML and CSS, I was like, you know, I was learning all these tags, his uh, CSS properties and whatnot. And I was like, what do I need to build, right? So then this daily, daily UI challenge uh, appeared from a recommendation and what actually happens with this you put in your email address and then every day you receive some sort of uh, challenge like if you go on dribble.com and you search for daily UI day one or something like that because there are like 100 challenges You'll have uh, all these designs, yeah? And it's amazing, but this daily UI, it's more like a challenge for designers so they can come up with different things like login forms, uh, weather apps, etc., etc. But this is not the best for, um, for developers. So then I found out about this thing called uidesigndaily.com and let me show you what you have to do. You go to uidesigndaily.com and then you click on Figma, which is an app that allows you to see styles for different things. And you choose something from here, something that is like appropriate for your level. So if you are a complete beginner, you can start, for example, with this thing, which is enter password. So what you do is you download the file. Okay, let's download the file. And it says day 1583. So if I go to my Figma, anyway, there has to be a way to import them. I'm not gonna figure it out now. I'm sure you are smart enough to figure it out on your own. And what you do with Figma, you can analyze every single color, font, padding, margin, literally everything. And then you create these UI challenges and you can use CodePen, okay? You can use CodePen and then you literally create every single day one thing okay today you are making the enter password form then you create the page header then you create rent a car ui design then you create this and so on and so forth until you become extremely comfortable with using html and css okay and then once you're good with that then you can create websites and whatnot but the cool thing is is that if you start learning some JavaScript, then you can start implementing JavaScript into these applications, right? So for example, here you can learn how to validate a password. You can toggle a class and then, you know, make this toggle go to the right whenever you click it, right and left, etc., etc. et cetera. Um, you can click on this button to show or hide the password. Like you can be extremely creative with all this stuff and it's about starting small if you start small then you can create complex things because every single application is made from smaller applications and each smaller application is made from even smaller applications okay so i guess this is like a good challenge for someone that's uh, struggling to get started you know i would definitely do this if i would be you uh so go on uidesigndaily.com i'm sure 100% that you'll massively benefit from doing this challenge. Again, this is a quick video. I hope you like it. And uh, if you want to join the mentorship program right now, it's closed. But if you want to be on the wait list, the link is in the description. Put your email and name in there and I'm going to mail you when the doors are opening back again. Uh, I'm clo I closed the program because I'm changing it. I'm make making massive changes to overcome this, you know, hiring freezes and layoffs and whatnot. And if you want to be part of that when it's ready, then join the waitlist. Anyway, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.